Good morning. Well, the Salvation Army, for one, has a shelter in downtown Minneapolis, and the executive director there tells us they've opened 25 additional beds in response to the bitter cold. We call them Arctic overflow beds, um, and there's a there's a lot of work in the community with um, with different churches and civic organizations to try to open up shelter when these really frigid temperatures move in. Just last week, the Minneapolis Park and Recreation Board voted to stop allowing homeless encampments at parks because of complaints over violence and drug use. And the board already suspended this for winter. So you can see these emergency shelters are critical. And at the Harbor Light Center, that's uh, through the Salvation Army there, they also serve more than 1,200 meals on weekends. However, more help is needed. It might feel small to to give a set of hats and mittens, uh, you know, one hat and one set of mittens. But I tell you what, to the person that receives them, that's a big, big deal. And you don't have to go out into the bitter cold yourself or approach someone who you don't know. You can make a donation online through the Salvation Army's website. And we have a link to that directly on care11.com. Yeah, so many people want to help and those are some ways that they can do it. Kaya, thanks.